Recently, I picked up my most expensive pair of shoes ever, the What the Doran Becker Dunk Highs. And in order for me to pay for these shoes, I'm actually selling one dozen different What the Shoes. And I wanna talk a little bit about what it means to be a sneakerhead to me. Being a sneakerhead is about buying, selling, trading, collecting, and wearing cool shoes. And for some reason, resellers get a really bad name. And I've been reselling shoes for a long, long time. And it actually is what enables me to collect shoes like this and to buy a pair of shoes like this. For me, I'm not made of money and I don't have a money tree. And in order to buy a cool shoe like this that costs more than $10,000, I have to actually make a sacrifice. And my sacrifice is these one dozen different what the shoes. I wanna tell you a little bit about why these what the Dornbeckers are so special to me and why I needed to have them. Back in 2008, I bought my very first pair of What The Dunks, and I was inspired to complete the entire collection of all the dunks that make them up. It took me seven years. And then Nike announced that they were doing a What The Dorenbecker Dunk High, which is comprised of 13 previous Dorenbecker models. Now actually it's 14 different shoes because one of the dunks that was used to make this up was retro, so it came out twice. But back in the day, I used to buy and resell shoes from the Nike outlets. And I used to pick up all of these OG Dornbeckers. Like, check this out. I'm actually wearing a pair of Zoom FC SBs, one of the original Dornbecker shoes that I bought for $14. And I bought hundreds of these shoes. And I think it's amazing how well Nike has evolved and that they're not just giving away these shoes at outlet stores, and now they're making them super exclusive. Like there are only 11 pairs of these What the Dornbeckers in the whole world, and only one in each size. This is a size 11. My What the Dunk collection is a size 11. I'm now gonna look to complete the What the Dornbecker collection. So actually, if any of you have any of the shoes that make this up in a size 11 to 12, please reach out to me. This is my passion. I love collecting. I love buying shoes and selling them and trading them. In this case, I'm basically trading one dozen different cool what the shoes for this shoe. Come on over here. I want to show you these what the shoes real quick. These shoes are actually on eBay right now. You can search for Shoeseum What The and have your pick from the collection. We've got the What The Max collection right here from 2012. It's an Air Max 90, 95, and 2012, which are a mishmash of the Olympic rings. Then we've got the What The Kobe collection right here, starting with the very first What The Basketball shoe, the What The Kobe 7, and then each successive model, the 8 and 9. Over there on the far side of the table, the What The Kevin Durant collection with the 5, 6, and 7. There's actually a sample pair of fours that I've never gotten my hands on, but the first time that they made a What The KD shoe for the public, it was the five. The sixes are really cool. They're actually made up of 35 previous Kevin Durant models because his number is 35. And then the most recent What The KD is also cool. It's got a bunch of lightning references because when KD was a kid, he wanted to be a meteorologist. And then of course he plays for the Thunder. Down here, we've got the What The Trainer from 2013. It's a mishmash of a lot of cool colors and prints, and that's what earned it the What The nickname. And then a couple pairs of What The LeBrons. You've got the What The MVPs and the What The LeBron 11s. There are sample What The LeBron 9s that I never got my hands on. Nike's making a What The LeBron 12 that's coming out in early September, unless they botch the release date. They're also coming out with a What The Max 95 that recently released in Australia. The What The Shoes are continuing to grow and grow and grow. And for a split second, I was able to say that I had them all, minus the KD and LeBron sample that we talked about. But it's a sacrifice for me, and I'm going to be selling those one dozen shoes on eBay. Search for Shoeseum What The, and I'm doing it to pay for the What The Dornbeckers.